Hello guys, this is Jatin Mithal. Welcome to our demo video of digital marketing course. And in this video, I am going to brief you about what digital marketing is and what we are going to cover in this course. So first of all, let's start and talk about our us. What is the agenda of the training is that uh, we will give an introduction about us and the overview of digital marketing training program. What is digital marketing and understanding the basic things and processes of digital marketing and then query session and then overview mod overview of all the modules and how to make money online with digital marketing it is going to be very long one so i will be just skipping few steps and giving you an overview about digital marketing and the processes so first of all you have to understand what is the objective of the training is in the objective of the training we will be talking about how you can become an expert in marketing any business online product or services with in-depth knowledge and practical exposure we give everything completely practical in the whole course and once you become an expert so you can work as a full-time or a part-time freelancer in digital marketing so that is what we our objective for this course is or for this training is how we can make you an expert in just three months or just uh, attending our query sessions or just attending our sessions is that we give in-depth knowledge everything is done practically you will be making your own website you will be learning through assignments and case studies and we will provide you all the industry leaders no comment trainers so that is how we make you an expert we give in-depth knowledge we cover everything practically we make the web we let you to make your own website and do the assignments and case studies so what will be the outcome once you do all these things then you become you can plan conceptualize and implement digital marketing strategy by yourself that is what we deliver you can you will be capable enough not able to track and monitor the performance of digital marketing plans but you will be able to plan conceptualize and implement digital marketing strategy so that's how you become an expert in digital marketing training or an expert in marketing any business online literally believe me guys so let's proceed further and talk about the digital marketing process digital marketing is a very big thing and we have to talk about that so first of all what uh, what digital marketing is well as, it is as simple as that when you start marketing online using digital devices this is known as digital marketing what are digital devices computers tablets uh, mobile phones uh, digital watches are these digital devices so this is what digital marketing is when you start marketing on digital devices this is digital marketing okay now let's understand the digital marketing process in the digital marketing process we talk about these six things which are very very important in the whole digital marketing first is the visibility when you are visible to people then after visibility you bring the targeted traffic to your website once the targeted traffic comes to your website you create an engagement on the website and if the user get engaged within the website then you convert the user once the visit user or visitor get converted you measure the performance of your campaigns and once you measure the performance of your campaign you improve your campaigns and you retain customers or the visitors let me give you an example of each one of them like if we are talking about visibility visible on google search engine we will be running paid ads on google that is what we are going to learn and this is known as ppc or running ads with google adwords and it your ads will be live in just two hours you don't have to wait for months and years to be live on google uh, you will be just live in next five, uh, two hours once you make the account and once the account is made you can be live within five minutes as well okay that is one thing we are going to learn the next thing is the banner ads you can run banner ads like you see over here mr modi is running uh, running for the last year campaign or the last to last year campaign and he won the campaign just because of digital marketing so that is what you are going to learn over here next is once you are visible to your audience you you are you are available everywhere once your visibility keep on increasing people are going to click on such ad once people click on such ads
okay once you bring the targeted traffic to your website you will be having lot of people coming on your website or your fan page or your landing pages that we are going to learn in this course so the question arises are we bringing the customer the potential customer to our website or just the traffic as we have seen in the website uh, in the visibility phase we were talking about running ads on words like buy shoes when somebody is searching buy shoes is it a target customer or not the answer is yes he is a potential customer because he is itself searching what is uh, buy shoes or what is digital marketing so we are bringing the target traffic so i hope you got the answer once you bring the traffic so there are two types of bringing the traffic targeted traffic to your website one is inbound marketing another is outbound marketing when we talk about inbound marketing let's the target market try to reach us when we talk about outbound marketing we try to reach out to the potential customers so if i talk about in this case the customer is trying to reach us because he is typing then our ad is shown to him so he is looking forward towards the product so he, it is an example of inbound marketing and if we talk about this particular ad where mr modi is trying to reach you is an example of outbound marketing whether you require it not but you are reaching to him that is an example of outbound marketing whether you do inbound marketing or outbound marketing it doesn't make a difference if you are getting the potential customer because only the potential customer are going to click on it because those who are not interested will not going to search and click on it so i hope you got it then next is engagement in a research it has been said that 94 5% of the people who are coming to your website are mostly not interested in buying directly or in the first phase only 5% either look to buy or they want to weigh their options so how we can deal with those 95% people we can deal with 95% people by giving an engagement what is an engagement engagement is a doing a, a visitor is doing some activity on your website like he is navigating throughout the website he is watching out the video he is just reading the blog he is downloading some ebook this is an engagement where you engage with the people why we try to engage with the people the reason is suppose let's suppose he is visiting more than 5 uh 3 to 5 results when he go on search when he starts visiting those five results he might not be buying in that time but he will be start engaging with one website who is giving the engagement like a watching a video okay like we do, we are giving you a video a demo video so that you can get engaged with it so this is engagement and it is very very important if you are not giving engaging people then that means you are losing out 95% of the visitors and if you are losing out then you are not converting actually you are converting very less number of people so that is why engagement is very necessary it could be a video it could be other pages it could be a blog anything okay or giving a free trial as well this is another good example of uh engagement we are giving a trial <coughs> we are giving infographics to download a free webinars to download that is what you can give an extra in engagement okay after giving engagements you try to convert people so there are two types of conversions happen one is micro conversion another is macro conversion what is micro conversion micro conversions are the small conversion which happens on our website which lead to a macro conversion or you can say those conversions in which you don't get the user detail that is micro conversion and what are macro conversion macro conversions are those conversions in which you get the user details or the final goal which you want to achieve like in service industry you want the contact details of the person then it is a micro conversion and uh, sorry macro conversion and when we talk about uh, watching out the video that could be a micro conversion checking out our blog is a micro conversion okay then fifth thing is measurement how good you are it is immaterialistic but you have always a scope of improvement how you can improve you can improve only through measurement for measuring you have to track and measure the performance of each and every online marketing activity understand the behavior of the user and performance of each and every web page so when we talk about that so you will see in this screenshot we are comparing almost seven 
different online marketing channels that uh, through which we are promoting so if you look at this uh, the people who are coming through organic search that is SEO results those people who are coming here are 10,000 so we know 10,000 people 10,324 people exactly coming to our website you can see they are spending four minutes and if you look at the paid marketing there are thousand uh, there are thousand people are coming and you can see that they are spending two minutes so you see that people who are coming through organic have, are spending more time that means they are more interested in our product in comparison to paid search so we get to know the response of each and every marketing channel so that is measurement so next next month you will be spending more time on organic less time on paid search once you are uh, you convert you measure then you have the option of retention so there are two types of retention one is retaining visitors another is retaining customers how you can retain visitors we you can retain visitors through various engagement plans like uh, giving them uh, once they subscribe uh, our blog, you can send them blogs, you can send them videos, that is retaining customer, retaining visitors, how you can retain customer is giving loyalty programs and all this is retention of customers. So this is, it. do you have any, any query about this digital marketing process? You can put your comments just below this video or ask our sales consultant, they will surely help you up with that. Okay, so this, was a very short brief about us and the digital marketing process if you want to know you can go to our website and check out what all modules we are going to cover with you in this training process so i hope you have enjoyed this video and if you like this video you kindly post out your queries just below it and we will surely revert back to you in time okay bye bye see you next time in the class, I will.